you guys could hear. And I bet you guys thought you'd never see these again. But, um, I was going to do this years and years ago. But I just wanted to show you guys all the uh, uh, wooden Thomas strands that I've collected over the years of uh, collecting these. And this is something that I thought I guess I could bring back to the YouTube channel for all the people who have been with my YouTube channel since first day I uploaded. But I will be uploading other videos as well. And I was supposed to upload a while back, but I was on vacation uh, out summer, so I couldn't upload, but I'm back. And yeah, I just want to show you guys my chain collection. And yes, I know uh, these two have stuff on them, but I'll get that clean. Alright, so let's start out with Thomas, Henry, James, Percy, Toby, Duck, Donald, Oliver, Neville, uh, Bash, Dash, and Fernand. And yes, I painted the footplates on some of these because I thought that was cool. Uh, Bert, which I just got on my vacation. I think this is pretty cool. I got them for only a dollar at a market that I went to while I was out. Uh, Den, Dart, Sydney, Paxton, uh, Diesel 10, Scruff, Samson, Ryan, Stepney, and Bell. Uh, those are my normal engines. Time for my uh, narrow gauge engines. Um, I have Rusty, Duncan, Smudger, and Luke. And for my road vehicles. Uh, let's start with the Thomas and Friends road vehicles. I have uh, Birdie, Terrence, Oliver, and Nelson. Right. Yep, Nelson. I, I I don't remember seeing the last episode he was ever in. I was thinking, uh, hold on. because I I don't see Nelson that much, and Thomas and Friends. Well, I barely seen, I barely seen him that much. I couldn't remember if it was him or Patrick, but then I remember it was him. Uh, so now these are like Imaginarium, which is like a different brand. So Thomas and Friends. This is a I guess a little mini truck with a that comes with a trailer that is detachable and a mini little black car all right so now i'm going to go on to my coaches now this is just some extra stuff that i had from whenever i was uh getting my stuff out of that little green basket Now, uh, this is the top, these are Tom's friends coaches, uh, and the other coaches, I should probably bring these over here. Okay, so I have the Express, and for the non-Thomas coaches, I have a blue coach, which I think is Imaginarium, and an old red coach. This is one of the first wooden items I ever got when I was, like, really young. And I'm most likely sure that this is Brio. Because the coupling looks different. Alright, so now on to the rolling stock. I have the old version of the Giggling Chubs and Trucks. Uh, he does n this does not work uh, now with one of my other trains that uses those little batteries. Uh, I tested to see if it was the batteries. It is not the batteries. I don't know what's wrong, but... Um, the zoo cars with the uh, ones that have like the feeling on them. The red one is the ram car. The blue one is oh, oh. the blue one is the llama car. Oh, sorry, that hurts on my outside. And the green one is the lamb. Or sheep car, sorry. Next up we have Rickety. The bee car. To kill Thompson the bees. I don't know if you can hear it, but it makes like a weird noise because I think it may be a little bit messed up. Um, the little construction cars that came with Rusty, I am missing the load in it. Now this is something that I also got while I was out. It is Isabella's trailer. I'm putting this with my rolling stock because I don't have it with her. Oh, I just shook my camera. 
Now this is the non Thomas Rolling Stock. I have some Imaginarium pipe cars. I'm pretty sure they are pipe cars because I think the pipes came with them or something. Uh, a yellow little freight car or truck. Uh, now I know this is Imaginarium because it came with my Imaginarium train table. And this one that I don't know what color it is. I guess it's like beige or something. I don't know. Someone help me with that. So in old, I'm, uh, this is, this has to be Brio. Uh, because, like, I don't know what it is. It's, like, an old flatbed that I think I have, like, a couple of. I don't know where it is. Put that back there. It fell. Uh, I, I know this is Brio because it didn't come with the others. Uh, a mail car. It isn't removable. It probably is, but you just have to take screws on. That's not what's meant to do. Now, here is a random old coal tender that I use, I use as, like, a coal car. But, yeah. Now for my brake bands, also known as cabooses, I only have two. This is the Christmas, or no, it is the winter caboose. I don't know what this came from, I think it came from a DVD, but someone in the comments let me know what this came from. I do not remember, but I'm pretty sure I got it in a DVD because none of my other trains are winter themed. And I have an old, uh, red caboose that I at one point used as toad, but uh, I had a taped face, but then I took it off. And those are my uh, brake bands, also known as cabooses. Here, now here are my extra engines. I have six Thomases, I mean, no, five extra Thomases, three normal, one with a painted foot plate, one that I completely covered in a marker, the Thomas that came with the uh, honey car or bee car, the holiday Thomas. It goes between uh, the orange, yellow, green, and red lights four times. I think it goes uh, orange, yellow, red, blue. I mean, orange, yellow, red, green. It does it four times, so that means in total it blinks 16. All right, now, here is James and his original livery, which means uh, paint color from The Adventure Begins, and it is called Introducing James. But yeah. Oh, no. uh, we have an extra Percy with a foot plate painted white, and two Tobies, and an extra normal one, and one with a uh, painted foot plate. And next, we have Streamlined Emily. From whenever Emily was imagining being uh, streamlined and fast like uh, Connor and Caitlin, and I think mainly Caitlin because it has that design similar to Caitlin's tender. And I don't know why I use these other ones. So uh, I have Dash, which I. Which, yeah. I use the normal one. So, uh, I have an extra Dash, don't know why. Uh, an extra Paxton. With the wheels not uh, the color that the other one was. With like the orange uh, painted wheels. And I think it has like different details to it. Now this is my old Diesel 10. Uh, when I was younger, I took this to daycare and I slid them down a shelf and it broke. Uh, we have Patchwork Hero. Next. And uh, yeah, those are my, that's, that is it for like my main extra engines. I have one early engineer. Uh, themed engine, and that is Stanley. And I have one battery-operated engine, and that that is Rosie. Next up, I have my extra narrow gauge engines. I have Renea, yellow Renea's, also known as Renea's new coat of paint. Duncan, whose foot plate I uh, painted, along with the buffers on the back. It's not the best job, but I mean, I did the best I could. Now this one is sea-soaked Victor from the Blue Mountain Mystery movie. Now, a long, like a while back, I did not know Victor was a narrow gauge engine until recently. My extra road vehicle is an extra Terrence that I painted, I don't know why. I just painted two of my trains blue-white. Now for my extra rolling stock, I have Rickety. Now here are the extra engines that aren't Thomas that I have in my collection. Now I have an Imaginarium, uh, Blue little tank engine. 
an Imaginarium little black tank engine, which I think might actually be a tender engine. I don't know. Because it doesn't look like it has like one of those coal bunkers or designed to where it looked like it would be. Like this one sort of does, but I don't know. Um, a red tender engine. I think the tender goes with it because this says four and so does this. I don't know. But next up, we have a skeleton train or like a Halloween train. Uh, it comes with the tender, which I think should... It looks. It would look better if it was like flipped the other way because it slants down towards the train, but I think it would look better in the opposite way. Now this is one of my, also one of my very first trains because you can tell which ones were my first ones because like the, they have like the old black ones. This is a yellow diesel engine that I think is Brio because I got it from this set that had these little uh, supports that go up and up and up in a spiral and then goes down and it came with like this little shed that could fit too. Now here we have an Imaginarium uh, green diesel engine that came with like the giant uh, train table and the other stuff. I don't know where the train table is right now. It's probably back in like storage because I don't have all my stuff here with me. Well, this is the stuff that I could have with me. Uh, a red Brio diesel from a long time ago. And those are my extra engines. I'm going to show you the uh, my tracks and stuff that I have with right now. Now this isn't all of them, this is just the ones that I have with me right now. An old, short, uh, straight piece. A Thomas and Friends little, uh, switch. This is the little one. Imaginarium, uh, road crossing thing. It's like a crossing. And a little, a Thomas and Friends little sloped piece that goes down. Um... Five long, big, curved pieces. This one is normal. This one, I don't know what that is. I think that's like from egg or something. That's from a long time ago. This one has a little, uh, this little end broken. Uh, this is, I think, a normal one. But this one has this end broken. Now here's an arched bridge. I don't know where the other two pieces are. I know one is at, is somewhere else, but yeah. Here are three short uh, curved tracks. And two crossings, one from, I think, Imaginarium and one from Thomas. Now here are my little figurines and also like mini accessories. Here we have like a rogue uh, light or railroad thingy, I don't know. This sign, which I think it might mean slow down or yield or something. I don't know, a tree. I know I have more of these, but I don't know where they are. Um, this little Toys R Us uh, cargo piece. Rest in peace, Toys R Us. Toys R Us was a good place, but it closed down recently. Right now, for the uh, figures or characters, I have a Thomas and Friends conductor that I think came with like a signal box or something. I don't know. Uh, now we have three Imaginarium people, one conductor, I think, or something that's filling up something. Uh, a police person or a security person and a worker that looks like someone from like a quarry or something. And finally, uh, here are the animals that I have. This is the ram, the llama, and the sheep. The, and their uh, exact order that the trucks were in. But yeah, that is it for my Wooden Rally Thomas and Friends collection. If you guys want like a Trackmaster train collection, let me know. I will probably do that sometime later. I'm making sure I didn't miss anything. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I will see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.